So who's ready to talk about what's happening on a spiritual level for this week? Yep, you ready? All right, here we go. So next week, not this week, but next week, I think next Thursday, we have a new moon in Leo. So we are between the full moon and the new moon at the moment. So we are finishing things up still. We are wrapping things up, getting things done that needed to be done, right? So it's going to be a fairly calm week, um, very balance very even for this week um there may be some little obstacles some little speed bumps that you have to maneuver over but they're going to be easy to maneuver over they're not going to be any big problems whatsoever they're just going to be just little opportunities to overcome just little ones teeny 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 tiny ones um next week at the new moon we really want to think about how the rest of this year is going to go. Like I said, I think in the last couple of weeks I have been talking about what do you want to see happening in the next six months? Let's focus our goals on January. What do we want to achieve by January? We need to be working on those things. So whatever you have going on at the moment, it's time to wrap those things up so we can start something new, start the next new task coming up next week. So what will that task be? So right now is the time to be thinking about that. What's next on your to-do list? What big thing do you want to conquer next? And I'd say, instead of starting off with the easy things, go ahead and tackle those hardest things first, the big goals. Go ahead and start attacking those things because once you move those out of the way, everything else is gravy, right? Yeah. So this is a week that the energy is really going to be pretty calm so that you can get things done. You can mark things off your to-do list. And I'm thinking about my own to-do list and what do I want to do next? Hmm. We'll see. Have a great day, everyone. And remember, you have the power to create the life you've always dreamed of. You do. Get outside, touch the earth, cleanse your space, do your meditations. And remember this, Wyatt, the wolf, the raven, and spirit, we're sending you unconditional love. Mwah.